Now, if you've been to my channel before, you know I really like smart bulbs, RGB lighting. I really like the versatility you get almost more than the ability to turn your room black, red, and blue. You can use them with your home assistant so that you don't have to get up and flick a switch every time you want to turn some lights off. Now, one of the main problems with that is cost. If you use certain brands like the one that I have back here in this light, they can get up to $60 a bulb and that can end up being pretty expensive. So that's why I always love to check these out. We have a budget LED smart bulb. This is from Tekken. Let's go ahead and open this up and see what's good. Ah, let's get this paper off of here. Yeah. Go ahead and get that out of here. We don't need that. Now you guys know I don't like to do a lot of specs, but before I pull this out, I do want to let you know this is rated up to 13 lumens. Now the bulb that I got back here is one of the brightest bulbs I've ever used. And it usually is rated pretty high in the brightness scale, and that's only 1100 lumens. So we'll put them side by side so you can see the differences a little bit later on. Let's go ahead and pop this open. I mean, and this is it. It's a light bulb. I don't know what else you were thinking about. I'm gonna go ahead and install this and let you know what's good. Now to get this set up, you're gonna be using the Smart Life app. I suggest you use the one out the Google Play Store for the best results. Now follow the steps to add the light. First, it needs to be blinking. Once it's blinking and you're logged in, you can follow the steps and it should pair up pretty easily. Now that it's set up, let's showcase some of its colors and options before we put it head to head with my LifeX bulb. Also, the good thing about these bulbs is that you can add them to your Google Home or other smart device settings so that you can control it with your other smart devices around your house. Now to compare it with the LifeX bulb, let's put it head to head. I'll be using the color options out of Google Home. Now I'll just say this, I've tried a bunch of different bulbs and they all respond to these colors differently. So if things look kind of weird, just remember that. To get it started, let's go with daylight. Up next is dark red. Here we go with indigo, which was the best representation of purple I saw. We got navy blue for that deep, classic blue color. And finally, forest green. Now after the head to head, I still think the LifeX bulb is overall brighter. It has somewhat more vibrant colors, but when you look at the price to performance, you can get three of these Tekken bulbs for the price of one of those. So when you think about outfitting them in your whole house, you really need to put that into consideration. Overall, I'm not mad at this bulb from Tekken. I don't think it has the best overall light, but I will definitely find a place for it in my setup to add to the overall RGB goodness. Let me know what you think down below, which light was better, which one is worth it, all right? I'm gonna get up out of here. Make sure you like, share, subscribe, and never forget to holla at your boy.